Hey everybody, welcome back to the show. Well, you may have just seen Terry David Mulligan in our last interview, and guess what? Our next guest <laughs> has a very funny story about Mr. Mulligan. He does indeed, and he also happens to be uh, in the final arc of the uh, Smallville franchise after 10 years in Vancouver. They're wrapping up the last episode, two-hour finale this Friday. Michael Dangerfield joining us. He plays Gordon Godfrey, if you've been watching Smallville Hello. after a while. Yes, Mr. You know Mulligan. he's evil! Mr. Mulligan, the non-tipper. Okay, let's... Uh, he's, a, he's a non-tipper. Michael, let's go back and to 1993, shall we? Uh, tell was, us where uh, you were. I was just starting out as an actor, and I had a, a, a morning room service job uh, at the Bradgate Arms in Toronto, this hotel. And uh, so I wheel up this stuff, and I don't even know it's for Terry David Mulligan when I'm wheeling it up. And <laughs> Broadcasting so I, icon. Yes. yes. And uh, But I recognize, of course, the door opens to Terry David Mulligan. I'm like, whoa, it's you. And you sort of have that moment, and you're like, wow, okay. And and uh, so I wheel it in, and then and then he doesn't tip me. And, uh, you <laughs> really? know, Yeah. And I'm kind of like, oh, my God. So, okay, I didn't get it in because you don't get a lot of tips for morning room service stuff, anyways. Like, maybe it was yeah. like back then it was like a dollar for right. coffee or yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like, oh, that's great. My much West guy doesn't give me a tip <laughs> like that. And so, then fast forward to our so, green room. No, no, <laughs> then I then he actually called down at once I got back to the kitchen and he's he said, Hey, I, I forgot to give you a tip. That's and then a I went he gave me ten bucks. That's that is yeah. a Terry yeah. David so Mulligan. So pretty good. So he is a tipper. He's just delayed See, on the tip. I think he owes me 10 bucks, so can I borrow yeah. he probably. And whenever we go out for lunch <laughs> with him, he always does the, oh, jeez, oh, hey, uh, oh, forgot anyway, the Anyway, let's get to Smallville, Ooh. ending uh, a decade on television, which is amazing. And you are going to be in the series finale, not just the yes. season finale that's yes. coming up. Bad Tell man. us about your character that you play. Uh, Gordon Godfrey, uh, he's one of the minions of uh, Dark Side, which is sort of, I know it sounds all sort of, what? Uh, Dark Side is the ultimate evil doer uh, on the show this season, um, and so I'm one of his uh, one of his minions with two others, and we're trying to convince the world that superheroes are bad. Well, and, and, and that's not very nice, by the way. I know something's got to force evil, Superman to become Superman too at some point, right? It's why, what? Someone's got to force Superman to to accept his role. Yeah, I guess, and all the fans are kind of like, you know, when is he gonna put up the suit on? But uh, I don't know. It's just it's been so fun to work on this show. I mean, the the crew and the cast and everybody is so welcoming, and you just want to give 110. percent I mean, it's just a, it's, it's a family over there. And it's sad to see it go from Vancouver because yeah, it's a uh, supply. Job jobs for so many amazing people. <laughs> Somebody told me at the rap party, actually, that they spent $800 million in, in Vancouver shooting the show over 10 years and employed 5,000 actors. You're kidding mm -hmm. me. And some no. people may not know. Now that counts background and, yeah. you know, I think every, every capacity of actor. Of money. Amazing. And some people might not know Tom Welling is the executive producer of another show called Hellcats. Hellcats and yes. when you were first on set doing your scene <laughs> with Mr. Welling, what did he say to you? We were, while we were about to do this, like, really intense scene, uh, that's, you know, sort of me as a, at my ultimate powerful moment, you know, as I'm possessed by dark side and I'm sort of, you, you and I will be together <laughs> and take over the universe and this whole thing. And, and I'm getting ready for that because you have to get intense and get ready. Yeah. And, get and evil. He, yeah. And he's like, oh, by the way, uh, good job on Hellcats. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you know, just to put it, I was like, you're my boss from the other show. We're doing this scene here Fourth together wall, now. What's am. happening? Because you've got a recurring on Hellcats? Yeah, I play the announcer for whenever they go to competition for all okay, the cheerleading yeah. shows or whatever. And uh, yeah. So That's not very evil. I know, I know. It's sort of, it's pretty opposite. Well, and no pressure at all acting with your boss on the other I know, series. I know, I was pretty, I was pretty nervous. I was, I was kind of like, man, I better like be good here. Because, yeah. uh, you know, it's, and this is the big scene at the end when I have to like, you know. And what boss. happens? How does it end? Yeah. How, how does it the, all end? The, that show or this finale? <laughs> <laughs> Not Hellcats. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's, um, uh, walking into a show like that, it's been going on for 10 years. I mean, uh, especially when you're coming to the end of it as well. It must be interesting, uh, you know, as an actor to walk in there and, and see people that have really developed a, you know, a very deep bond with each other as, as a crew. It's amazing. And as no, a, it's, they really are a family and they're so welcoming. I mean, they really like, you know, they just brought me in and I, I felt comfortable after the first day and just was like, I just want to give you guys my absolute best. Yeah. You know, and... Uh, I've heard that from so many people too, oh, yeah. you know, because and, there, there would be that sort of tendency, I think, to, you know, 
like, oh gosh, you know, they've all known like each other. Like we are so here. Long. Yeah, just, you know, we jerks. Form <laughs> no, you guys are welcoming here too. No, it's, uh, I, I was actually, funny funny story, I was I was actually the last actor to be shot on Smallville. So your scene was, one of your scenes time. was the last scene on set. In the finale. Set. It was the last Ever. one, and we, we were do, I was doing this monologue as Gordon Godfrey, and I was up at the mic as I sort of speak to my fans, or, well, not fans, but the followers yeah. on this microphone, and I'm doing this, you know, really intense scene, and we did a number of takes. So it's me doing a monologue, and, and, uh, you know, we did a number of takes, and then the director's like, and cut! And the first AD yells out, and that completes 10 years of Smallville! Like this, <laughs> oh yeah, and it was just clapping and hugging, and, and I'm Crying? like, oh yeah, no, it was just, it was really, it was really surreal to be a part of that, mm -hmm. and to be the last, per it was wild. I mean, yeah, it was no just, kidding, you know, it was right? a real we honor. To I'm totally to honored. Too. Um, why don't you set up what we're gonna see here? Well, this is the scene that actually, when we were talking about when Thomas, good job on Hellcats, and then we shot this scene. This is when I am at my full most power as this Evil Gordon guy. Godfrey, like possessed by dark side, and I'm, you know, about to like literally have these crows come out of me and go into him and, and take over him, and he and I are gonna take over the universe, and, and uh, so that's what happens, yeah. Here is a scene from Here's Smallville. Michael and his boss. <laughs> Godfrey! I'm here for Lois. That's too bad. Her idealism and blind faith in the vigilante she loves has gotten her in way over her head. What have you done with her? Let her go. Lois has served her purpose. She brought one of you to me. Are you sure you can win against me? You know what I am. You know the doubt in your heart. <laughs> you so-called heroes are false gods, all of you. And when people stop believing in you, you'll shatter my glass. Just tell me, where is she? Good job on Hellcats. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all dark. And my and voice intense. is not usually now, that Smallville deep. Smallville has sir. die hard fans. Uh, what has the reaction been like uh, to your character on the internet? Have you looked yourself yeah, up? Absolutely. You yeah. There's been some. Good, I mean, there's definitely uh, there's been some interest to get me out to some conventions. I'm yeah. talking with somebody in uh, in Australia, actually, at a convention called Armageddon. And, <laughs> of course. Uh, you know, of course. And, you can uh, live yeah. off that stuff for oh, yeah, us. No, so yeah, absolutely. You it's, do it's, have a bit of a saucy scene in one of the past episodes uh, yes. from, I think it was uh, either so last week third or week time, before. Yes. Third time you have brought up the bondage episode this morning. Yes. Bondage episode? I wasn't talking about that. <laughs> but while we're talking well about it, we're getting but while we're bondage, there, yes. uh, yeah, you have a bit of a... a, a so it was fun. quite a scene. It was quite a scene. I, I'm going to get in trouble. My wife is probably watching this, but uh, no, it was. It was. Uh, Erica was in a whole leather decked out head to toe suit. Lois, and, yeah. And uh, Lois Lane, Erica Durant, who was such a good sport about it. I mean, she just, you know, she was like, "Oh, let's just have fun, whatever." And <laughs> I'll be, another day at the you know, just, I was like, "All right." She goes, "Put your hands wherever you need to, whatever. Just do it." You know. I was How like, often do you have a beautiful you know, woman in latex saying, "Do whatever"? Not often. No. All the all the crew guys were like, "Oh, tough day on we're on set, I am like, uh, <laughs> And the reaction on the the internet has been interesting with that as well, right? People well, I think, like, I think people were sort of like, they didn't like it as much because they were sort of like, they're like, oh, it was a, a bit racy. You know what I mean? It was sort of like, yeah. they were like, yeah. oh, you don't want a bit too far. Well, you're <laughs> evil. You know, like, you're a very bad man. And if you want to check it out, the series finale, I know, Michael, right? Michael, his character, <laughs> you. The character I was talking to him man. as his character. Uh, okay. But you can check out the series finale of Smallville. It's happening this Friday night at 8 o'clock on The CW. We're going to take a break.